Now the first thing you probably obviously are gonna need if you don't already have a domain is a domain name. Now I use GoDaddy, it's just um, it's just where I've always bought my domains from. No real preference. So obviously you're gonna be figuring out exactly what your domain is gonna be. Um, and yeah, let's, let's just, for an example here, let's just put an affiliate income. And I'm just completely throwing something on there just for the ease of this video. So as you can see, that's actually, someone's trying to sell that as a, a premium um, premium one, but you know, let's just use it use it as an example. This one here, the .co.uk, you can buy for 1p, um, you know, that's if you take it for more than one year. So let's just say that the .com is available. You're gonna go and add that to your cart, put in all your information, buy that for between six and 10 bucks, and, um, and away you go. So really simple. You know, I'm not going to teach you what to do and you know how to name your domain. Um, you just need a custom domain that's going to uh, describe your profit funnel and um, you know what you want to do with it. Give you an idea. Uh, I mean, I've got many, many domains. Uh, I mean, for instance, I've got Get Paid Like Rob. You know, if your name was Simon, you could have Get Paid Like Simon .com. Um, I've got Instagram Training Secrets. This is my training course website. I learn anything. Um, Laptop Lifestyle Hustle. I've got Millionaire Laptop Lifestyle.co.uk and .com. Millionaire's Drive, MLM Marketing Expert. So as you can see, you know, it's just what we want is to make sure that your URL looks nice and clean. Let's create a new funnel and let's just quickly just call it test one, two, three. And let's just select any template. I'm just showing you this as an example. So right this moment, your profit funnel is going to look something like this okay it's going to be a big long ugly domain now i when i first set my click funnels account up a couple of years ago we were doing training courses so i called mine online training courses you might have named it your name you might have named it your business name but the reality is is you're going to have this big long ugly um, whatever the name is first dot clickfunnels.com forward slash whatever you name this part of the funnel and then the second one will be exactly the same forward slash whatever you name the second page so you can see there look thank you um, and obviously I've already got probably pages that are thank you so then it'll add a load of bunched up letters so you really want to have a nice clean domain if you're going to be marketing and, and sharing it on Facebook on Instagram and in as many places as you can that's the idea of a, a custom domain so you're going to hover on account, click on custom domains. They've actually updated this recently, make it much easier. So you can actually do this nice and simply now. So you've got a few different options down here. Um, setting, a cup, setting up a custom domain manually, that's the way we used to have to do it. Or you can go to setting up custom subdomain. Uh, so if you want to run the, the subdomain off of your current main domain, then that's fine. So we're going to click on this one here. And as you can see, they've changed it recently where you can do automatic custom domain and subdomain setup. And if we go back to, um, if we go back to today's training, well obviously this is where the video will be. If you click on here, this will take you straight there. So I'm kind of giving you a bit of a shortcut. Uh, this is just the help section. So as long as you're logged in, uh, it may go there without being logged in. And then without me walking you through this, you know, literally holding your hand, there are already videos here which do exactly that. It will take you five to ten minutes. Look, you've got screenshots of everything. Uh, it's about as simple as it gets. You're going to set up a Cloudflare account, which is free, uh, and that's where it's going to host your domain. And the, the instructions are, are very, very simple. So once you've done that, once you've completed everything, and that's... Um, that's actioned everything you need. What you want to do is come back, let's go back to that test funnel, and you need to change your settings. If you want the entire funnel, every single page, to have your custom domain, then you're just gonna to go to settings, and you're just gonna click on the drop down here, and obviously your one domain will be showing. So let's for now just put funnels qualified, and then scroll to the bottom, click save settings so you can see now that's changed to https um, funnels qualified.com forward slash 
opt in. So now what I want to do is change this ugly end bit. Okay, so let's say this is um, you know, profit funnel one. Okay, so this is for my reference. And then this is the path, this will be your forward slash. So you now see that's changed there, funnelsqualified.com forward slash profit dash funnel dash one. And you also need to come in here and just double check that's carried across, but it hasn't. So we're just gonna paste that in here. Paste that in here. And you are done on that step. And obviously you're then just gonna do the same thing for the next page and the next page, and if this was um, just a thank you. If you've already got another thank you page somewhere else, we could say profit funnel thank you. Okay. And it should let me do that because I don't believe we've got a PF thank you. So you can see here, no funnels qualified PF thank you. And let's just double check in here. And that is as simple as setting up at your custom domain. So once you've done that, go into your profit funnel, find your profit funnel and change all of the custom domain settings on all of those pages and, um, and we'll cover, the, cover a few more bits on the next step.